Here's Alicia Malone with Hugh Grant at his red carpet premiere in Sydney. He wanted to talk to her about his new flick called Did You Hear About the Morgans? And then he wanted to talk to me. It's been two years since we've seen you on the big screen. What was it about Mark Lawrence's script which enticed you back? Well, it made me laugh. I thought it was really funny and um, actually quite touching. And uh, I was intrigued by going and making a film in the Wild West. I'd never done that, you know. I've always liked Westerns. I quite like the idea of myself in a cowboy outfit. <laughs> you looked good. Well, I wish that were true. There's my client. What's he doing in the hospital? Did you hear about the Morgans? This guy is still out there. I recommend you both enter the witness relocation program. What? what? I can't commit to spending the rest of my life with my husband. I know exactly how you feel. Welcome to Wyoming. It'll be an honor to protect you. I hope you'll be real comfortable here with us. Oh my God, it's Sarah Palin. It's not technically a romantic comedy because it strikes me more as a couple's caper comedy. Good. Like something that Good. Doris like Day... That. Yes. Yeah? Yes. How do you describe it to people? Yeah, I go, I go along with that. It's not because it's not a romantic comedy. It makes me think I've done something different. Um, you know, it's not boy meets girl. It is a um, much more difficult subject matter. It's, um, it's marriage. And, uh, and as I said before, it's about whether love can really survive marriage. Now, one of your most interesting co-stars in this film is, of course, The Bear. Yeah. So how did Mark Lawrence go about um, giving both of you notes when you're in the same scene together? Mark Lawrence is a... Um, timid um, New Yorker from the Upper West Side who's never really left Manhattan and was terrified of the bear. He didn't go anywhere near it. The bear was entirely directed by its owner. He does it with, with bribery, really. With the, the, if the bear does anything right, it gets 12 cans of iced tea. And if he does something even better, he gets a, a, a saucepan on a long stick and uh, puts whipped cream in it and the bear licks it up. So that's like a giant bear spoon, that saucepan. Yeah, a giant effect. spoon, yeah. Speak in a soft monotone. My wife is a member of PETA. I have been meaning to join. 